Hey what's up guys, I'm Nizio Cole and 8.30 is finally out and I've gotten to play it and it's actually a pretty nice update and I'm just gonna basically go over the highlights of the update in this video and yeah, let's get started. Now we get this every season, whatever theme it is, whether it be the Christmas theme or the Easter theme or whatever, we get a set of challenges to go with the theme of the season and this season is obviously like pirates. Uh, well, kind of like 25% pirates, 25% lava creatures, 25% ice creatures. But uh, yeah, we'll figure that out at the end of the season. But the Buccaneers Bounty Challenge comes with an absolutely hilarious emo. I'm going to play it for you guys real quick. So yeah, it's just four challenge, four days. I was going to actually do a video series on it, but I didn't really feel like that was really necessary because it, it, they're pretty easy challenges, to be honest. Just some other details I want to go over is that there is an improved frame rate counter. There's a little uh, UI thing that shows your skin uh, whenever you're talking in voice chat. Uh, also, when you're talking in voice chat. Also, when you open your friends menu, it also shows the skin of the people in your party. And I think that's a pretty cool feature. And it's also the animations are nice and smooth. But in 8.30, we also got some new versions of other skins, such as the Link skin. We got a version without a ponytail. I don't know why that was requested of Epic. So you're telling me that they can't revert Siphon, but they can give me a non-ponytail version of Link's. Priorities. Priorities. As well as the Rose Globe pickaxe and the Wild Streak, which honestly I want you guys to tell me in the pickaxe. I'll put some footage up on screen of me using the pickaxe. I want to see if this goes with my fit because I've used the Rift Edge pickaxe from, I believe it was the Drift skin in Season 5 with my fit, uh, the Rose Team Leader and the, uh, I forget what glider I use, but um... I've been using that for a long time. That's just kind of my signature fit if you've been watching my videos for a while. And I just want to hear you guys' opinion and see if this pickaxe fits me well. Just let me know down in the comments and I would appreciate it. Another thing that they added is that they changed the events tab to compete, uh, which I don't know why they did that, but probably for the World Cup. The World Cup is actually now showing up in that tab now. So it shows the next three weeks. I think 13th and 14th is solos. Week after that, week after that, duos. So I'm pretty sure, yeah, we're, we're all going to be competing, so... Yeah, most of us, maybe some of us will be streaming it too. So make sure to tune in for that. And the last thing I'm going to be talking about is that they actually added a miscellaneous slot for rap. So bows and, and other things that you just don't know where the rap is going to go. Uh, you can just add a little, a little rap in there. I think that's pretty cool. And that's pretty much all I had to talk about in this update. Pretty small update, but added a lot. The reboot vans are in. We talked about that last update. Nothing. It works as expected. You reboot instantly, pretty much. And there's nothing really too special about it, except that you get another shot. And I think that's a pretty cool update. Before I go, I just want to let you guys know that we recently got a creator code, Nizio underscore team. Make sure to put that in the bottom right corner of the item shop if you want to support us. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you leave a like and subscribe for more content like this. And I'll see you guys later. Peace.